This is Maintainer's Series 6 all aluminum PM uh, lube unit that we can uh, provide on that Class 6 chassis. This one is equipped with nine pumping kits and it is hydraulically operated for the six oils, antifreeze, and evac recovery. We do have a 120 pound grease kit as well. So with the nine pumping kits, we actually have 725 gallons of live product capability, and that uh, provides uh, a lot of onboard oil with uh, the additional capability of evac recovery. Um, with that, you can see in the back all of your controls and everything the operator needs for his service is conveniently located at ground height, so he doesn't have to climb up and down. Basically, gets to the job site, engages his PTO and main power, and then can come back here to the unit and activate any of the control pumping systems, lighting that he uh, wants as far as operation. They're on demand, so basically, at this point, you just flip on one or multi kits that you're going to want to pump, and they go live. So basically, just grab and go then with your meter dispenser, and we do have a nice uh, filter bin here uh, that they can lay the uh, filter used cartridges down for draining and that is set up to recover from the evac system uh, through a ball valve that can uh, load that into the evac recovery tank when that does get full. On the passenger side of the truck you can see we have a nice tool bin access area there with our dual lock set and plenty of storage for new filter and other uh, components the mechanic may want to take along. Here you can see the all aluminum tank set up with the quick fill system. So all tanks on this unit it is an option to have a quick fill. Uh, with that we do have an indicator light in the back to let the operator know when the tanks are getting full. And there is the hydraulic air compressor uh, for air service, blowing out filters, radiators. And again we do run the uh, greasing system with the air. On the driver's side of the unit you can see we've got a nice access area with a door that closes uh, to kind of conceal the, uh, the area and make it a nice streamlined look for graphics or what the customer would want to put on for their company logos. Again, additional uh, storage for new filters on this side, some of the additional tanks. And here's a nice shot uh, that does depict the capacities that we have on board on this Class 6 all aluminum loop truck. And with the unit loaded, as we mentioned, there still is a lot of nice payload available for those filters, tools that they may carry with this package. I will mention this is the Class 6. We also have the Class 5, which looks very similar. The Class 6 is the 22.5 GVW on this unit with a four-wheel drive chassis. So this one is set up with a 108-inch cab to axle. Our Class 5 version is very similar. It is, drops it down to an 84-inch cab to axle with a 19.5 GVW. It is set up with the exact same number of pumping kits, uh, the nine pumping kits, but uh, the tank capacities drop down to 525 gallons uh, with that smaller GVW package, but we still have a very similar amount of payload left over. In the center deck area that we accessed on the driver's side, you can see we have a lot of nice room uh, to get around if you're doing top fills with the tanks. And in addition, we did have the unit set up uh, to be very easily serviceable. You can see the solenoid controls uh, for the pumping functions. Right below that is the filtration system, so very easy to get at, access, and switch those out. There are indicator lights uh, in the back of the truck that will let the operator know when they need to be switched out. And then the pumping and plumbing is very conveniently laid out if there is any need to access or do any maintenance with the setup.